right outside my house getting uh uh, checking out new drain lines that were put in. So the idea is, is that storm water is gonna come from the front of the house, which was previously on the street. Um, but now we're gonna be routing it back to a dry well in the back of the house. So they used ABS piping. Uh, I requested that they left the intake this high so that I could do future rainwater catchment and pressurize the system to this elevation to to feed a, uh, a uh, future uh, rain barrel or cistern. So you can see they line the pipe with a uh, wire so it can be picked up by a metal detector in future work. I think this is a uh, three inch pipe, maybe three and a half inch pipe. So here's a uh, the tr Let me see if I can focus this. Here's the trench along the exterior of the house. Pipe just sits right in there. Pretty close to the house though. Kind of see how narrow it is in here. A few feet wide. I'm just gonna try and walk back here without disturbing too much dirt. Okay, this looks pretty interesting. I'm not entirely sure what that is. Um, this has been exposed before this, so I think it's a sewage pipe. Uh, interestingly though, here's the main sewer line going down deeper right here. Looks like it had a previous upgrade perhaps. So this is graded down. Here's the intake at the, at the back of the house. They got it really close to the house and I think what their plan is is to connect the gutter straight down to this intake. So you can see the trench. Uh, they dug under and around this grape bush. Looks like they did a, a great job avoiding the base of the grape. So coming on around, oh, they came back from the backyard. It's very difficult to see, but the trench is along the back here. They're, they're digging in between my flower beds. The trench is now coming down the middle here in between these uh, second two flower beds. So you can kind of see here, here's a corner point. Um, I requested they uh, leave an intake right here and this will be for future uh, uh, rainwater impoundment project. So that's really cool. They left that up. You can kind of see the the trench along here and my my raised beds. It's November. Still working on trying to get some cabbage going. So just so you can see, here's the back of my house. I know it's very dark, uh, but the trench is going along that left hand side um, around midway to the backyard. Um, it's about two feet shy of a, it's almost in line with a, the neighbor across the street with uh, their garage. Okay, so let's keep going down this trench. Okay, so curves around and back here, it's connecting with the drywall. So they have the drywall all covered up right now, but it's, uh, it's two drywall. Don't know if you can see this, but I'm just gonna stick the camera down here. 